This is State Representative Jeffrey Elmore. I'm excited to have the opportunity to represent the new 94th District in the North Carolina House. A beautiful district running from the clear shores of Lake Hickory in the Bethlehem community to the famous gem mines of Hidnight, to the foot of the Blue Ridge Mountains in the Thurman community. Along the way, you experience rolling hills with hardworking family farms producing the next meal on your table. The forest lands that give us the materials for our homes. In the center of it all are the Brushy Mountains, where orchards have been producing apples for over 100 years. What makes this district so special, truly, are the hardworking people. Through determination and self-reliance, we have experienced the birth of NASCAR, Fortune 500 companies, and even Bo and Luke Duke of the Dukes of Hazard. The factor that has made all of this happen and keeps the businesses and people pushing forward are our values. Values that are not just spoken words, but lived every day. Our people believe in hard work, and they believe it will make you a better person, that nothing is truly ever free, and they know what is best for their families. We believe in God, and He blesses us every day. We believe you honor your nation's flag, and you stand for the national anthem. We believe in protecting our families with our right to bear arms. We respect our law enforcement because we know they are putting their life on the line every day, keeping us safe from the evils of the world. This November, there's a clear choice put in front of the voters of the 94th District, a choice between a candidate that represents our values we hold and that have made us who we are, or the vision of an elite class that wants to fundamentally change who we are as a people. I ask that you stand with me and your values, with your vote and support. We must stand strong to keep Wilkes and Alexander counties great so we can face the future together. I'm Jeffrey Elmore, and I approve this message, and I ask for your vote November 6th, paid by Elmore for NC House.